All right, let's say you're creating a website and you're going to base that website off of a template. And the reason you might want to use a template is that you can create the template once and then you don't have to create a whole bunch of links. And so you just sort of use one file as the, as the template for a whole bunch of files. We won't go through the whole thing, but let's just say we have uh, a table on our uh, site. Um, and then maybe we have a, a, another table within that table. Uh, let's see. Uh, do, 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 do. Let's go and insert a table. Insert a table. There we go. And let's go like that. Okay. So this is a pretty, pretty bare bones site at this point. So you'd be working on the site and you would be putting in your images and getting it, you know, getting the template up to where it needs to be. And one of the things that sometimes is confusing for students is if, let's say we have a, a link to the home here and maybe there's a research or some other things, whatever, it doesn't really matter. And then you want to link and you're doing this on the template. Now, the, the files that you're linking to don't exist yet because you're going to use the template in order to create those files. So what you do is you link to a file that is not yet in existence. So I'm going to highlight, for example, home. I'm going to come up and link it. And then it's going to ask for the location. Well, our home file is going to be called index.htm. So we'll put that in, even though it's not there yet. And we'll say OK. And you would go through and you would link the other, the same sort of way. So do link here and so you create another one. And so on. Now we link to those files and what we're assuming is that, is that those web pages will be in the same folder that the the template is in. So they're all going to be in the same spot. So when you go to create those pages you need to make, put them all together and all you're going to do is, and of course you'd need to have, this page just doesn't look so good. So it needs to be, you know, complete, absolutely complete. Nothing else needs to be changed. It's just exactly the way it needs to be. When you are ready for that, you're going to do a save as, and it needs a title in this case, whatever. And we're going to save it, except uh, we're going to give it the name. In this case, it's going in, in documents, but you'd need to put it in your own folder. Um, Index.htm. So that's the first one. Okay. So pay attention to where you put it. They all need to go in the same place. Click save. And then you turn around and you do a, another one. Same thing. Except this time. And again, no, notice where you're putting it. And so you'd go through all of the pages that you were going uh, that you that you basing that you're basing on the template, save them all, and then you go back and edit those specific pages. And, and the advantage of doing it this way is you never have to go back. And in, if you've done it properly, you never have to go back and put the links in again. The links, uh, as long as you name everything correctly, will work on all of the pages that are based on the template.